What's going on, everybody? We're playing some historic, historic. I I guess it's just as we're playing some historic. <laughs> it's kind of like there's no other word that follows that. Um, we tried to play this deck last night. I played two rounds. I did a whole intro for the video, and uh, I played against two fields of the dead decks. Uh, lost against them both, while they made six two twos from putting into play one land. And I was kind of done. So I went to bed, hopeful that Field of the Dead would be banned when I woke up. And it was. And now we get to play uh, against no Field of the Deads. There are not enough sol nine lives solemnity in this deck. Well, that's true. But that's because that's just a janky ass combo. <laughs> So now I can take Massacre Room out and Virulent Plague. And now what do I add in their places? Goof. Goof. So anyway, the, the deck we're playing is a Demonic Pact deck. We're basically taking advantage of things like Treacherous Blessing and Demonic Pact by flickering them. Uh, unfortunately, it was discovered by Rob that you cannot actually flicker Treacherous Blessing because once it's targeted, you have to sacrifice it. So you can't flicker it to draw three more cards. But you can flicker it, flicker it to get rid of it. So we have three flicker of fates to blink things like Birth of Miletus, uh, Banishing Light, you can retarget something else, Treacherous Blessing to get rid of it, Oath of Kaya, Demonic Pact, uh, or Cavalier of Dawn or Bantu. So I think three mana Ashiok's might be good. I do, I actually always forget about Ashiok, but yes, I have typically had Ashiok's in a lot of my black decks. Um, no Gideon. I had Gideon at first, and then I just wasn't super impressed by him. Like, not only do you have to keep Gideon alive, but you also have to make an emblem. So, I mean, there's we have enough ways to get rid of Demonic Pact that I don't think it's going to be an issue between four Doom Foretold, two God Eternal Bond, two, three Cavalier of Dawns, and um, three Flicker of Fates, and two Final Payment. Final Payment is also a pretty sweet removal spell that says uh, sacrifice a creature or an enchantment to destroy a creature. So, basically... I mean, you can sacrifice your Birth of Miletus or even the wall it makes if you want to if you want to get rid of a creature. Oh, you can sacrifice Treacherous Blessing. You can sacrifice an Oath of Kai after you cast it or a Demonic Pact. There's tons of ways to... Tons of things to sacrifice. Um, basically, I, I think um, Gideon was pretty unimpressive. He was so good for me. Interesting. Interesting. Let me take one flicker out. I... <sighs> We'll put a Gideon in. Dun, 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 dun. Just put him in the deck. And what else are we taking out? Probably... Let's put one Wrath in the sideboard and put another Gideon in. Now we have two Gideons. And our sideboard is complete. I'm going to try him out for you, Rob, even though I didn't want to use the wild cards. But, yeah. I mean, there's a lot of synergies going on here. We also have 25 lands, but I figured that would be offset by the fact that we're drawing with Treacherous. I actually do want another black, because there were definitely times where we wanted to play multiple black cards in the same turn. Thank you! What was this? Six, I mean, tell them so there's 16 black sources. Maybe it was a fluke. So seven, eight, nine white sources, and versus six. I think we're cutting one for one. Elk Tears with a resub. Thanks to Dan's for my gift sub. I appreciate you, buddy. Man, welcome back, my friend. Welcome back. Uh, so this is six, seven, uh, independent black sources and six, seven, eight. So this is seven, eight. I think that's probably fine. I craft all. Use the stupid Gideons. Okay, but see, now that I have Gideon, I have to actually go to the store and get the Gideon. So. You know, don't want to not have that guy. I also feel like I should get these, because I'm going to feel real weird if I have one, but, you know. Okay, so, this is our deck now. Also, Gideon is another win condition, so. I bought that today, too. Yeah, I'm like, oh, how convenient. Alright, so now we're going to try it out. Oh, what up, Jimmy the Mole?
Um, seems fine. It's a little awkward. Is there a way we can f configure this to hit Chapel? Let's just play turn two Thoughtseize into Ardenvale. Yeah, I think that's fine. I, I think we're going to leave this Chapel here. I guess we could have let a Swamp Ardenvale into Isolated Chapel. That would also be fine. Ah, oh, yes. Now Muxus can run free. Yeah, all right. Goblin Chieftain and Goblin Matron. I think the Chieftain is more threatening than just getting one Goblin. And we're going to play Ardenvale because it's our only white source and we don't have a way to put it into play untapped yet. So Then we can go Gideon into Demonic Pack. Yeah, just play some Pact Navigations. A card that is on actual blank unless you draw the Gideon. I, I mean, I like the idea, but... I don't think that's a solid strategy. Oh, fascinating. So Gideon goes up to four. Spectre seems decent here. Are we just getting Mux this, this turn? I mean, they have to have drawn a Muxus in the two cards we don't know about. That guy's good. Alright, so Gideon's dead. Oh, what up, McGimp? Love Yarok? What are you saying right now? Okay. Well, this isn't a pumper. Nah, that guy's... That guy is. Yeah, I think we're just dead here. They just get a Goblin War Chief, sacrifice one of the matrons, play the War Chief, and then it's 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Yep. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Seems good. Okay, so take the flickers out. Bring in Wrath of God. That's pretty much the only card we have that's really great against them, unfortunately. Is Cage good because of Muxus? Like, it comes in and puts him right in play? Yikes. Mm, actually, pretty okay. Sure. Keep it. I'm actually going to put the Pact back. Because we don't have a second black here, but I think all of these are pretty good on turn one, so. Hmm. <clears throat> Uh, Wily Goblin, I don't care. Again, I think Chieftain is probably just... I mean, Matron gets a Chieftain, right? So is that just better? 
I don't actually know. Probably. I feel like Birth of Miletus is pretty good. I both really like and I'm really surprised that uh, sagas are not legendary. My recommendation is to accept that Ariel Laxative is a troll and uh, nothing he says is actually genuine. Seems good. Yep, that's... I mean, this deck is really good. So this might be the deck to... This is the deck that's the deck to beat now that, that field is gone, I imagine. There's this four, five, six, seven. I mean, we're not dead. We can t always top deck one of the three rads in the deck, right? If they can draw... There we go. <laughs> uh, that's, that's what you want to see. Like you do. <laughs> Oh, we know they're drawing Castle on Breath. I think we're saving that. And that is why. Nice. 
nicely, nicely drawn. Yep. <sighs> Let's go to the next match. Yeah, apparently Cage is very, very good against them. That's a lesson to learn. Yeah, man, I have no idea how to fix that sound issue, and it's kind of frustrating. Rob, I, I love you trolling me about it, as if, like, I can just fucking easily fix it without devoting hours of my time to it. That's fun. That's good. Hmm. If goblins is a big deal. How do we beat it? No, I actually haven't heard that from anyone, interestingly enough. So I actually don't know. Like, the problem with, with fixing a sound issue like that um, is that um, it's kind of difficult to pinpoint where the problem is. Is it a problem with recording? Is it a problem with uploading? Is does Anchor lower the volume when we upload it to Anchor? Like, does it is it is it a, is it an isolated incident on your on you know on your device? Uh, the meta game has not proven. Like, if we played one game, I really don't think we need three Wrath in the main yet. Like, I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Like, if the metagame is all goblins, I can understand, but, like, otherwise it just doesn't seem... I mean, Settle just seems worse than Wrath, right? Like, giving them a bunch of lands. Take out one Bantu, I guess. Alright, we'll see if that's any different. Did we finish our sideboard? I think we got like 13 cards on the sideboard. 12? Yeah, let's... Let's put four Graftigger's Cage in. I think birth is really good. Birth gives birth birth synchronizes with everything. Flicker, final payment. It gets you lands. It gets you blockers. Um, I guess we can just go like noxious grasp, like two noxious grasp. Um, we Rob and I definitely considered Yorion. I think Eliminate is worse than most. People keep suggesting eliminate, eliminate. I think Eliminate is worse than most traditional two-mana removal spells. It's worse than Castaway. It's worse than Heartless Act. <clears throat> like, the reason is people are like, oh, it kills a Planeswalker and a, and a creature. But, like, what Planeswalkers are you killing? Like, Oko is not legal. Teferi is not legal. So, like, Narset is, like, the only three-mana Planeswalker. So, basically, it's literally just Smother. Where Heartless Act is better 90% of the time. Uh, 
I mean, I definitely think Eliminate is probably great in older formats like Modern, where they're playing Ren and Six or Oko or Teferi, right? But I mean, that's you know not historic. <laughs> I guess that's true. The Davriels could be an issue. You got it. Got rid of Gideon, huh? Well, that was a good draw. <laughs> um, yeah, we can just play around sensor, I guess. Now we don't have to. I'm going to get rid of Oath of Kai. I don't imagine this deck actually has many things that Oath of Kai really cares with. Cares with? Cares about? Wow. How how gambly are we? Rob, how do I keep track of both of these? I'm really kind of afraid. Okay, so one of them has... Discard two, draw two... Lose... No, it does not cross out modes. It doesn't show you anything. It literally just stays the same. I really have to remember where this one goes. This one's... Oh my god. How do I know which is which now? Okay. Okay, we're going to do the one on the right first. Right first. It's going to go on the bottom of the stack. Okay, they're gonna remove or la this was this was gonna go off first. Okay. Okay, this is the one on the right. God, I hope so. Oh Jesus. This is so confusing, dude. Okay, this is the one on the left. Oh, that's good. That makes total sense. So left one only has three modes remaining. Okay. Wow. Does it matter? I don't know. Holy smokes. How big is Teferi? Four, so they can even respond to draw two? Sure. I actually don't even know which one I want. This is a terrible design. I'm like, I'm extremely irritated by this design. Wow, this deck may be unplayable when you're playing multiple Doom, Doom demonic packs. Oh, 
I guess we just win even though I had no idea how to keep track of these. That's hilarious. Yep, let's get rid of Wrath of God. Bring in Agonizing Remorse. I, I'm gonna like tweet to them right now. Just continue to tell your opponent the other one has mod mode left. You'll be fine. Yeah, that sounds about right. Um, hmm. I can't imagine any of these are great. Yeah, I think it's fine. That's a keeper. Seems good. Narset, Nicobolus, Nicobolus, Ashok. This is a this is a deck I can get behind. Can't cause their controller to search for the library. Well, we got a birth in hand. Do we have an answer for Nicobolus? I don't. Narset's annoying. I mean, this is kind of rough because it shuts off our birth, but I guess we don't really care. I mean, I'd rather our birth get shut our birth get shut off than our treacherous blessing. So. Oh, fascinating. Hmm. I mean, we kind of want to guarantee we have a fourth land. So I kind of like Treacherous Blessing here, and then next turn we can final payment. <sighs> Solid draw.
to defend yourself. Save yourself and give up now. Sure. Well, having an emblem that says we can't lose the game is pretty sweet. Uh, let's draw two. Think so. Okay. I also tweet. I tweeted at them about it. I'm like, hey guys. Interesting. Is there an advantage to choosing to lose the game first before they have removal? That's actually a great strategy. I hadn't considered it because I wanted to get the value first. Um, but yeah, that's not a bad idea. Phoenix, Phoenix, Earthshaker. Every deck has Thoughtseize. <laughs> so that's a thing. Um, I guess we just take Thoughtseize. Come on, Gideon or Treacherous Blessing. Okay. So Doom Foretold, we play it, they sack this guy. Seconds. They sack this. If they don't play anything, goes back to our turn. We have to sacrifice Doom Foretold. I think we're just passing here. Yeah, I feel like everyone has complained about this battlefield. It's just very complicated. I'll block if you want to shoot this with something that's totally fine. Alright, so yeah, now we have a couple turns of Doom Foretold. No, we don't, actually, because it goes back to our turn still. And we still have to sacrifice the Doom Foretold. 
Interesting. Hmm. Where were you last turn? I mean, we can go Thoughtseize Blessing. Could be fine. Yeah, Tim, you can, of course you can link, buddy. Um, hmm. We really want a Treacherous Blessing before we Doom Foretold. Something's missing here. Four cards, this is Escape 3. Uh, that's the yikes. <laughs> alright I'm going to watch this in a minute it's only 51 seconds oh boy so we're at 11 we go to 9 I feel like we have to block here yeah alright I'm just going to use the timeout I guess if we wrath I guess they get one dude back Oh, an Ember Cleave and a Regisaur. Yeah, that's pretty good. Let's get rid of the Cleave, though, so we don't die. Um, I'm going to decline for now. It feels like I'm like struggling against aggressive decks. Okay. So we play this, we take one, we go to six. They can play Croxa. They do need lands. They can't do anything without lands. It's definitely one of these three. One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll have seven next turn if we play Birth, which is like Banishing Light and Doom Foretold. I mean, another hand is Registrar, and we'll just Banishing Light. They're definitely due for a land. Oh, yeah. Ruins is a land, alright. They still can't cast Crocs. So, well, no, they can't. They can pay life. Never mind. What do we get rid of here? Probably Doom Foretold. Or no, we get rid of uh, probably Birth of Malise. So do they have another one they can get back? No. And they don't have, they can't, yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. 
So we can definitely play this, go to two. Or go to two, yeah. Maybe play birth, go to one. Is one different from two here? I don't think so. client so much. I look in their graveyard to see if they have this. It's not in their graveyard. Because it's up here. Cool. Super cool. It's really annoying. I'm like, hey, I thought they had another phoenix, but I don't see it in the graveyard, so I guess they don't. <laughs> what a dummy. I mean, I literally pulled the graveyard out to make sure that they couldn't escape it. Like, they didn't have another one. Because I thought they escaped it. I thought they, they exiled it to escape. It's like... I'm like, am I, unless I'm just like an absolute moron. Escape doesn't exile, I guarantee you, in order to use the card's escape ability, you have to exile cards from your graveyard. <laughs> if that's what you're saying. I kind of like just slamming Doom Foretold here as a way to just proc it immediately. Ooh, there it is. It's your boy. Okay, well I guess when they only draw one land.
What are you guys talking about? They sacked Phoenix to Doom Foretold and then escaped it with the top deck land. When you clicked on the graveyard, it actually showed. Oh, okay, cool. That's good to know. That does make me feel a little bit better. Okay. Loader, thank you for saying so, man. Because I know I've had an issue with, like, cards being over here and not being in the graveyard. And I'm just like, okay, but they're in the graveyard, so. I guess that's true. I guess Doom Foretold does give them a sacrifice, though. That's a lot of damage. Okay, I think we definitely need more uh, things early. Okay. Wrath of God one time us? Okay. Not ideal. <laughs> I come to the stream and there's still no... I haven't made any emotes. Even Katie needs a new emote. Okay. Okay. Rob, how are you doing with the deck? I guess you're gone now. Rob just left without saying anything. That's good to know. <sighs> Alright, so... Hmm. I think Flicker's probably too cute. Probably cut down on one Doom Foretold because it hasn't been doing as well. Get mayo in your life. <laughs> why, why? I, I, I think it's safe to say the Howie Tears emote is basically an Elk Tears emote, yeah. Um, God, what is the deck missing? What about, like, Seal Away? Does it matter? Does it have to be an enchantment? I guess it doesn't have to be. There's no, like... Enchantment synergies. Does Kaya do anything? Not really. I mean, maybe. I mean, the thing is, like, she gets rid of the one drops, and she also gets rid of, like, 
graveyard cards, which is not terrible. Exiles creatures under three CMC. Is that a, I thought that was a sorcery. All right, we're going to keep going. So we're one two so far. We lost to goblins, B Grixis, and then lost to like black red aggro. Yeah, keep. Hmm. Bottom. Eliminate is an instant, but that does not exile a creature now, so that's not what you're thinking. play one at a time i don't even know like the best demonic pact strategy when the client is like uh Braska and gilded goose in the garbage Man, three priests, huh? Four cards. I really don't think I want to play two. <laughs> Like, I just don't feel like it's it's easy to keep track of. So I think we're going to not play two. Okay, they're dead. Another Wrath. Kaya kills their one drops, so that's kind of cool. Why is Gideon electric right now? It's also not showing up when I hover over it. <laughs> what the fuck? That's weird. It's a bug, <laughs> clearly. <laughs> Wild. Zimini Pot, have a good afternoon, buddy. Um, Oh boy.
Got him. Well, I want to have a swamp so I can play Lock Thwain eventually. If they couldn't play anything last turn with four mana. Okay, I guess they could have. You get one wild growth walker. Sure. Not the most exciting. Thunder's having a little dream. This is one, two, three, four, six, seven, nine lands. It's one, two, three, four spells. Seems good. good too. It's kind of annoying. Do I take four and draw a card? No. But probably yes. Tend to anyway. Okay, well, we gained two of that back. Ari Laxative, I feel like that's actually a true comment. Five pounds of chicken into a gallon of mayo. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, are you just going to get rid of my vanishing line? And then you're going to get rid of my Kaya? Yeah, that's a good... 
That was, that's a good draw. That's not terrible. One, two, three, four. We can still draw a card too, right? Might as well sack them. Yep. Nicely done. Sure. I feel like Wrath doesn't even do anything in this format because they just, everything is such, everything, there's so much recursion in this format, everything just comes back, either Collected Company or Command of Dread Horde or Escape or... Uh, they played Command of Dread Horde. cut a land because of the amount of birth of Miletus's We also drew like very few action spells that game. Blood 
So they play Blood Artist next turn. I don't think we care about that. We have both of Kaya. So we're just going to play Birth with this guy. It doesn't look like they have a... Okay. I was going to say it doesn't look like they have a third green. A second green, but... I feel like Oath of Kaiang, this is... I mean, double green, double green. It might be correct. Well, we had 25. I just cut one after sideboarding for... I mean, we have three birth of Miletus' as well, so... I mean, they have to have a third green. We know they don't have one yet, so... Yeah, okay, that's good. We do get to keep Pact on board for a turn, which is pretty nice. No, we don't. Oh, they don't need a green to activate this. Wow, I'm stupid. Why did I think it was a green to activate? It's still one for one. I'm not terribly upset about that. Don't think Mal Birth of Miletus. He birthed my Cletus. No, 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 no. That's a good one to get rid of. And Gideon's getting pumped up. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we take four if we do this, plus the wrath, so that's five. So we go to eight. Cavalier, we kill this next turn, we go to seven. Time now. Not if I can help it. It's a I 
like that. Like this better here. Wanna get this off the board. There with me. Mm -hmm. Targeting a blessing with Gideon is bonkers. That's a that's great. It's a lot of things that are happening right now. Doom foretold. That seems worse than demonic pact. When you're at three. That's interesting. Sure. That's pretty good. That's probably game. Maybe not. They don't have that many scries. Okay, now they do. I mean, we're done on board, right? They just sack three things. <sighs> cool. All right. Well, deck is not doing as well as I hoped it would be doing. That's unfortunate. That's a pretty nice reward. So let's cut. Put another birth in. I gotta leave. Uh, I don't think Shalai does anything, especially if we can't actually activate her ability. I mean, we can't be targeted, but there's only we've only played against like one deck that really targets us, and that was the last deck. Like the black red aggro deck doesn't really care about that. The goblin deck definitely doesn't care about that. Plus, it's on turn four, so like by the time you actually get a Shalai and play, like they've already thought seized you or thought erasured you, so it's not like it's. I mean that's why I had like like things like leyline because of that because of that exact reason. <clears throat> Which I still think is fine.
maybe I'm not like sold on Doom Foretold. Like the problem with Doom Foretold is that like we play it, and like they usually have more things to sacrifice than us. Let's go with two Doom Foretolds. Why is blue highlighted? Because of Ashiok? No. Jennifer Watsio read and thanked me for my feedback about playing Demonic Pact. Nice. I'm literally trying to pronounce this name. I'm going from the back forward. I got Sauce Man, Egg Sauce Man. Ragu in a can, Egg Sauce Man. Thank you for saying so, buddy. Really appreciate it. I was like, oh god, hold on. How do we pronounce this? Uh, is this another deck where I just want to put Larissa in? No, because we only have like Birth of Miletus here. Badger with the gifted sub. Thank you, buddy. Really appreciate it, my dude. What about one Kunaros? Just as like a 3 through the game's life. Okay, not Resolute Rider. <laughs> Soren only gets creatures back, not permanents, right? I'm not even going to check because I'm pretty sure that's correct. Alright, let's try it like this. Well. What problem are you trying to fix? Uh, losing. Losing is the problem that we're trying to, trying to remedy. Yeah, Yorgana Thassa turns blink like blink one thing and blink your whole board every turn. Oh, Jesus! I don't even know you're in here. She's, she's she was creeping. I move my little comic device. I don't know where to put this. Put this on. Uh, Hopefully nothing breaks it. Oh, this seems fine. Oh, did they all come? Did all the boys come? Wally's been sick today. Wally's had a little stomach malfunction. Do you and Katie want to stream Fall Guys with Dan's and I Thursday night? Yeah. Mm, I'm going to ship that bad boy. Yes. <laughs> She is moving quite gingerly. She also has her glasses on, which is very uncommon. Is this part of the frame? Oh, I like these. I don't think I've ever seen these before. They're my normal glasses. These are my normal glasses. My eyes are not wanting to focus, so... Did anyone inform our opponent that Field of the Dead is not legal anymore? Probably not. That's unfortunate. 
I don't care about anything in their hand. Um. Well, we have a date. Oh. Oh. Rob, what do I take? The two springs or the the two the two other things? You can do whatever you want. It's true. Hello, Shua Gardner. You're you're moving a little slower today. I feel like. And most other days, we're moving at my normal turtle pace. Yeah, but at least you're a faster turtle on those days. Yeah, I'm like lady, speedy Gonzalez. These are the, these are the three cards we got today. This is what was in the mail. Yeah, those are my mail goodies, my mail grab bags. I like this one. This one's pretty. Your weapons won't help you. Your defeat is inevitable. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that form of the mold drifter. I'm straightening your pile because it's all. Caddy Wampus? It's all Katie Wampus. That's you! Let's attack them with this Gidgen. Andrew always called him Gidgen. No. Oh, I see. You're just making. I was itching my face. Yeah, that's... Slowly like this. <laughs> See, like, clawed off. I know my responsibility. <sighs> well. Every time I see Katie there, I worry for Michael. What if she got rid of him? Got rid of who? Michael. Who? He's already forgotten. This is hard. He's already forgotten. End the turn. I think we should hang something from that hook up there. I disagree. I think we should unscrew it from the ceiling. Hmm. <laughs> Slowpoke Rodriguez. <laughs> Rodriguez. What? Where's that? Oh. Watson, I don't know what he's doing. Just He's doing a little spin move. I know. Watson looking at me all confused. Look at these. Cats! <laughs> oh, boy. Dude. Uh, no, I don't like the 700s at all. Okay. Those Bye. look like weird cloud space shoes. Mm-hmm. Maybe I'm just behind the times. Maybe those are really what's... I don't think they are. That's cool. They want to. Hmm. <sighs> it's been a while since we saw Michael <laughs> hold his head up high. Well, that's a good song. It's been a while since we saw Michael they got two mines over here. Do you like only Nikes? No. Hmm. He likes Yeezys. Oh no. And Jordans. And he's even got a pair of Crocs. I do, but those are from years back. I forgot why I have those. Maybe work? I don't know, but we should we should wear them together out in the yard and do yard activities. Yeah, we should do that. The Don ones that are Spider Man. I don't even know what that means. I just made that up. Real quick to explain is the Croc. I was. I was like, oh, uh, oh. Uh. I have Crocs, but I feel like I can wear them because I, I work in a hospital. Wow. So it's okay. <laughs> but yeah, they're comfy AF. I had this one pair of Crocs. They were solid black. 
with no holes in them and they were made for surgery so that when you spilled guts and stuff on your feet they didn't get in your shoes and I sweetly once asked Franklin if he could bring them in from the car and he did not what when was this and they sat in the sun oh my god what <laughs> and then they shriveled up because they're little rubber shoes and they're like this big <laughs> they're like children's crocs and I didn't know that they shriveled and I went to go put them on my feet to go to work <laughs> and just my little toes <laughs> in each one of them <laughs> <clears throat> well <laughs> so I got new ones and they're prettier so upgrade oh that's pretty decent I always get a kick out of seeing a nurse in the ED when I'm dropped when I'm dropping off a patient. I don't know what that means. I assume that means emergency department. But I'm not sure why that would be funny. I don't even see these messages you're reading. Rylos24, the bright green guy. I see this. Trump. Yep, the one above it. Not Mossy Beard. Yep. Oh. When I'm dropped... Drop, uh, I don't know what's going on. I just have to do this. I just have to do this. I have, I have to do to, a thing. They're I making have me. to cast a light. I got, sometimes you just gotta cast a light. You know what I mean? You guys never spilled guts in your life? I, I've i spilled mean. guts spilled once. so many guts. Um... <laughs> No, I ended up donating them because I was like, maybe some child could use these. Crocs at a discounted price. Crocs at a discounted price. Wait, I thought you had a cute little goblin guy. A cute little goblin guy? These are both little wolfy guys. The pets? Or oh, whatever. The, it was a dragon. Yeah. Yeah, I switched mine. You can just click on it and switch it? Well, it's her. No, well, I mean, I can. This. If you click on the bone, it switches between these two different dogs. Oh, I see. Like, you got the fire dog, and you got the... The nightmare green, dog. The green dog. He ain't no nightmare dog. It oh, looks like Watson, he got are you? bathed in slime on Nickelodeon and where's, came back as a... Where's our Watson? Watson is right behind you. Hello, Watson. You're going to crush his nub if you roll. I will not roll. No nubs will be crushed this day. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Little Watson. Uh, I think Wally's still on the bed. In there. Yeah, this matchup seems also bad. What are you playing? Is this I... that black white enchantment deck? Yeah. Uh oh. You don't seem stoked about it. I don't. It's not been doing very well, which is really sad because I had really, really high hopes for it. Yep, now they got a Teferi and a Spyglass back, and one of our few cards in our hand is a Gideon. Oh, he does look like Gooigi. Who? The little doggy. <laughs> He's like made for Gooigi. I know what must be done. Goo, 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 Gooigi. Auto Autobots. Autobots? Wow. I feel like that went with the theme of the game a little bit more than auto parts. I don't know. You know, don't I look don't... at me. Okay. Does that grant? Does. What does it seem? I'm just where it's fused. No time for a break. Unseemly. I feel like I'm very far from the peaceful pup. I'll have to check after this. Oh. Guys, I don't feel like this deck was really living up to the expectations I had for it, unfortunately. Rob said it was doing very, very well for him. Rob, what happened? What's... Banishing a zombie and killing the other and attacking Karn. 
Tarbot exiles cards on top of the library until they exile an instant or sorcery. You may cast that card without paying its mana cost. What? What is this weird shit? This is my wand of chaos. <laughs> You're a wizard, Hattie. <laughs> Another classic Burt hype deck. <laughs> it's true. I have bad news. It's possibly going to be able to get to the pup in the next... In the Oh, no. That's really sad. I'm an EMT and drop off patients into the emergency department. All the emergency departments near me only... The old nurses with bad feet I wear them. Some dead things that needed to stay dead. Well, this time. Oh, oh, oh. Mm I was wearing my crocodiles when I got taken to the emergency department from work in an ambulance. My EMT was very nice. Mastery calculator. Today's date. Your current... This is really confusing. <laughs> Holy shit, how do I... No, this is... That's too much. No, this is like nightmare fuel. I don't need this calculator Somebody in my linked life. Um, shoes in the chat that you need to go look at. They're up a little bit, yeah. <laughs> Bless you. Oh, thanks. Mm, I don't like these. I don't think it no. No, these are just too bright. I don't like these Don ones. I've never even heard of these to be honest with you. Look at all my deck. They Bye. Get... <laughs> I don't even know what that card does. They Bye. look through it and pick a card or something and do something with I it. I literally read it out loud. I wasn't listening, I was in my own. Unbelievable. World. I just tried using that mastery calculator, and now I owe the IRS $1,300. <laughs> Same. What is this friggin' deck, man? This deck seems great. All these Karn, like, value decks seem real good. Auto parts. You better watch your back from here on out. You better watch your back. You better not cry. You better Jesus. watch your back. What are you? Oh, you're gonna die. <laughs> you better watch your back. Don't cry. I don't know what's correct anymore. So, what are you doing? This is a your, your sitting positions are very strange. Let's play a different game. Like a non-magic game or a different game. You're gonna have to specify. I'm very confused. <laughs> you notice how she didn't say anything after? <laughs> Did Mikey get gastric bypass? No, what? No. Oh, are you <laughs> Okay. I get it. Yeah, and he also grew his hair out, and, uh... He identifies differently now. Oh, God. If that's Mike, I want the number for that surgeon. <laughs> Do you really? You better not cry, I'm telling you why. Michael B is in the garbage can. She just said, I hate water. <laughs> so I hate water. Why doesn't water just taste like soda and I could just drink that all day? <laughs> Well, um... Why is everything dead in life bad? Hard to say. What do they ca They have to cast this? They just choose not to? Okay, that was... Alright, you got it. The ocean would be whack. <laughs> you just go in the ocean, you start drinking soda. You're like, wow, this ocean's delicious. And sometimes when you resurface, you can't open your eyes because they're stuck together. <laughs> Sugary, <laughs> syrupy deliciousness. And it's so carbonated. And then you gotta be like... Your whole body feels the tingle of the carbonation <laughs> as you're in the ocean. One, two, three, four, what five, is six, my seven, beverage seven, of seven. choice? 
Shirley, Shirley Temples. Yeah, I freaking love Shirley Sprite Temples. with grenadine. Otherwise, it's Dr. Pepper. With with grenadine. I don't like it as much with grenadine. I am going to concede. I just threw three lands. Captain Nintendo has bested us this game. Okay. Let's bring in... Heartless Axe seems pretty bad. Uh, so does Final Payment, unfortunately. Wrath of God, no bueno. Bring in Intervention. Bring in Remorse. Remorse. Eh, Remorse. Ashiok seems good here. I'm gonna dump, 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 telling you. Uh, what does Leyline do? Like, they're not targeting you with uh, approach, right? Like, I don't think they really target us with anything. Just like my sister, she doesn't drink pure water. There has to be some flavor, so she mostly drinks Coke. No one knows how much how those kidneys work with so much Coke. <laughs> A lot of people in the 80s can tell you how, how those kidneys work with all that Coke. If you know what I mean. Oh, the wand sucks, though. Like, I'm not really scared of the wand. Yeah, my kidneys don't work as well. <laughs> what we got here? Euro, Euro, Karn, Wrath? Get rid of Karn. That guy was a real problem. That guy was a problem, child. Ooh, big problem. Wand with second son is Wombo Wincon. How is that? What am I missing? Am I just like missing the fucking crazy wand? Do they target themselves? Because if they target themselves, then the, Leyland doesn't do anything. Can you bring the wand up over there somewhere? <laughs> just bring the stupid wand up. Just let me, just let me read it. I'm not an aural learner. I have an to... aural learner? Yeah. <laughs> A-U-R-A-L. I know what you said. Aural. Well, I was trying to make it not like oral. Yeah, target opponent exiles cards from the top of their library until they exile an instant or sorcery. You may cast that card. Then you just put the cards on the bottom of the library and in random random order. Like, it's just... Hmm. They basically just go through the top of your deck until they hit an instant or sorcery. It's not super exciting. I actually don't even understand what it was doing. Gonna find out, I'm telling you why. Santa Claus is coming. We could sing really threatening versions of all of the Christmas carols this year. The Demon Lord is coming to town. He's making a list and eating your kids. Twice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. Hello, Tot, Boss, and Mark, and Blessed X Checker. Yeah, but what if they put Approach in your deck? That's wild, dude. Who is this? My follow list is empty. That's not true at all. You're more of a leader, not a follower, dear. Uh, oh, they're there. Okay. So, you should look through this list and tell me what I should buy. Okay, so if it's the easy, mm -hmm. mark it off. Oh my god. Why are you gonna, you're really going to be this way? This is really how you're going to be? For the rest of our lives? What's the difference between the retro royal blue and the retro black royal blue? The two blue ones. This one and this one? No. Uh, this was released in 2017. This was 2013. This is the original. This was a re-release in 2017. It's basically the same shoe. And they look the same? Yeah. I'll show you both. Oh. Basically the same exact shoe. Mm. They're so expensive. I mean... I just want my Louis Vuitton. How can I... Kerwood, how, oh, how can I send... Yeah, this is StockX. No. Wait, what? What is... The shoes I want. They might be... It's a lot of lands, and I'm not necessarily thrilled with the amount of lands. Now we can cast all of our cards. Hooray! I can kill that idiot, I guess. Well, they have no graveyards, so that's nice. 
He's making a list. Kermit, how can I show you my my follow list on StockX? I don't think I can. Can you screenshot it? Yeah, probably. But it's kind of long, so. These are the ones I really want. One of them says no on the back, and the other one says photos. Those are cute. But does one of them say mean mugger on the... I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> trying to get out of Hell's Kitchen. Yeah, you can be on the special Sir Stroming episode. Oh, they're going to attack with this guy. So I assume you have Wrath of God because you have nothing in your deck that deals three. So I guess I'll block. You can Wrath. Right. To the surprise of no one, I will put that back in my hand. Beautiful. Oh, it's your favorite of mine. What you got in there? I told you already. It was Coke, and I had a little vanilla in there, and a little cherry in there. So it's oh, cherry I vanilla thought you diet Pepsi. That by now. No, I. I've been I've been slowly nursing it. Mm. Plus, it's twenty six ounces. That's a lot, a lot of Coke. <laughs> what are they gonna get here? They have one card in hand. I actually feel like this is not terrible. We're not doing terribly. I know it's hard for you to follow because there's a lot going on here. And a lot of strange, weird cards. Shut up and take my money. But one tiny bites by. <laughs> Whenever I do that, Hold on. that's a. That's Don't encourage the, him. That's where the tiny bites come in. Okay, <laughs> this is her venom impression. <laughs> How are we doing over here? Oh, just hunter in the dog bed. We get a little butt. Why is that hat in the dog bed? It, Cause it fell down there and it's just been stuck in there since. Okay, you got a meaty. Me, that's one meteor golem. You got a meaty golem. I would play Oath of Kaya, but so we play Doom Foretold. We kill this. They play meteor golem. They kill the Doom Foretold. One, two, three, one, two. I had a cherry vanilla Coke the other day. It tasted like an identity crisis. Huh. He's making a list. He's checking it twice. Gonna find out whose biscuits are nice. That's a little creepy for Santa to do. <laughs> Santa, what are you doing? Those are my biscuits. Don't look at those biscuits. So I can play Doom Foretold now. It'll immediately proc. And then you get we get the 2-2, two, two, the 2 life draw card. They discard. Then they play Meteor Golem, kill Oath of Kaya. No, they get to kill... Yeah, no, this goes off. Yeah, this is fine. The alternative is they play, like, Meteor Golem, kill this. Then we play Doom Foretold and they sack Meteor Golem. This is fine. But they can still play Meteor Golem, kill the 2-2, two, two, I guess. But they're discarding the other card in their hand. I'm stuck in Paper Mario. Already? How many hours are you? Like, three hours? No, probably not even. Really? I feel yeah, like so you played it for a bit. Dumb, and I'm like, should I look it up? Or you want I me just... to help? I don't know if I could help it without any frame reference or without having played the game with you. I was supposed to have a phone interview today and I got myself all psyched up for it. The interviewer never called or sent me an email. It's kind of demoralizing. My recruiter's trying to reach out to him. I hope. That sucks, Dennis. I'm sorry, buddy. Man. Maybe they just forgot. I forget a lot of things. Despite having like four different calendars. I can dream about you if I can hold you. You know that song? Wow, did you see that snake? Wait, you can sacrifice land permanence? Oh, wow, that's wild. I did see that snake. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're going to have eight lands. We can sacrifice two, right? Yeah. Oh, man. What a time to be alive. <laughs> 
Oh, I'm gonna actually play land and then agonizing remorse the stupid Euro. Maybe they got sick like I did and then they just didn't go to work. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. 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 How you feeling now? Can you mute it? Okay, hold on. She's gonna tell me how she feels. Now the mic is on. Okay. And then if I mute it. Okay. Okay. Did you guys hear any of that? I can't imagine that they did. We're going down, down in a chicken biscuit. Chicken biscuits. That's a messed up biz. <laughs> um. I don't think I want a Thoughtseize because then they're like, then they're one card away from just Euroing. I guess we have Banishing Light. Whatever. Oh yeah, I'm glad I Thoughtseized. Okie dokie. I'm feeling okay about this. About what? This game. Okay. Well, they're just gonna go. A pro oh, it's just a land. It's just a stupid land. Where does Mark live? Mark Rosewater? Please. Seattle? No. Oh, Mark? Br Brazil. Brazil. Brazil! Um, let's deal four to this idiot. Oh, the birth of Miletus. Your baby boy Miletus. He has been born. Congratulations. Wow, maybe we win this game, huh? You know, maybe we, hey, maybe we win. Uh, who knows? Who can say? I hope you get it too. Blessed. Den Dennis. Dennis. <laughs> De Blessed Dennis. Yeah, Dennis is a friend from Utah, actually. Oh, nice. We hung out like once or twice, and then yeah, like a card store, and then like COVID happened. So just again. like all of my other Utah experiences. Limited. Yes, very limited, unfortunately. Did I ever tell you about the time I was on the same flight as Mark Rosewater, but he, it was in a, he was in economy and I was in... Yes, you did, actually. I've actually been to Mark Rosewater's house a couple times. It's pretty nice. Oh, good. Oh, good. Eugene, Eugene. It's so easy to make you laugh. <laughs> You're just funny. You're just cute. I'm glad he thinks so. I miss first business class. Yeah, well, yeah, I, do you miss flights in general? Kind of want to draw two cards before they get rid of it. And I got this B light. Oh, they're just dealing three to me? They have cards in hand? I'm going to draw two here. Oh. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Hmm. Okay. Okay. So we can go five and four. Do we want to have two on the board? Ooh, that's a little scary, isn't it? Oh, I met Dennis. What does Dennis look like? Are you friends on Facebook? Oh, he was at the pre-release. With a tikka masala. Oh. He, he was the one who got we got Indian food with. Yeah. He was doing keto, so he didn't have... Yeah. Yeah. That was Dennis. Oh, okay. Yeah. Did we miss activating the castle? I'm pretty sure we did, yeah. Because I was afraid of Ugin. Eugene, Eugene! I miss the airport, weirdly enough. I've always liked the energy of those places. Like the frantic, panicked, disgusting energy. Because that's the energy that I get from airports. 
So this guy goes to four, and I don't think him negative fouring is actually going to do anything. I think we want to just get rid of Pact here. And then play Banishing Light on the Euro. And then just attack Ugin. Ugh. Then if they have Wrath, though, it's so bad. But I guess if we don't draw an answer to this, we're also just dead, so... You know. That's bad, too, I think. There are great places to watch people. But it's... I hate being the person that's being watched when I'm having like a frantic I'm late moment. And I also hate public running. It makes me really uncomfortable. So when other people's run in public or I have to run in public, I get really anxious. I think we're going to die here. I think I just messed up. Is that because you were running in public? It, every, every mistake of my life is because I was running in public. Yeah, me too. These are also two thousand dollars, so it's kind of holy babesis. Babesis. Babesius. You ever heard of Babesia? I have never heard. It's a popular infection. Okay, I think we've died. We just lost our own pack for the first time because we're terrible at this game. That's really sad. I was feeling good about this game too until I made a. Wait, is it a legendary enchantment? No, that would be great. Yeah, so you just play another one. Yep. We got a lot of outs there, but none of them hit. That sucks. Yeah, I agree. I should have killed it. I feel like I was... I, I really hate the timer in this game because, like, it's just kind of distracting, so... Yeah. Yeah, I feel like it's a lot more nerve-wracking than... Right, once go. once it's like... Tss, and you're like... Nah. And I'm like, oh, 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 what do I do? Oh, oh. So, like, your, your, your thoughts that are already, like, really rushed, it's just even worse. Either way... Demonic Pact was not where we wanted to be right now. Thank you guys for watching, though. Hopefully, we still had a good time. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at manatraders.com. They have a great subscription service. You can get 20% off the first three months of any subscription with the link down below in the promo code RATTRAIN. One word. And uh, Don't run in public. Don't run in public. And don't forget to kill your pack if it's going to kill you the next turn. So I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.